Hey everyone, today in this video I'm going to be showing you what a widget is and how do you use them. Hey, yeah, you probably scared you. I'm sorry. I'm not actually sorry. Yo, you know what you should feel sorry for? Not clicking that subscribe button. So if you could do me a favor and click subscribe right now, it's completely free and you can even unsubscribe later. Thanks. Enjoy the video. Now, how do you get to a widget is if you own a Discord server or have any admin power in a Discord server, all you're going to want to do is go to the top left of your screen and go to server settings. I'm doing this on my Discord server. If you want to join it, link below. I don't really advertise it much, but when I do, here it is. <laughs> join it if you'd like. Um, you go to the server settings tab, and for me, right above server template, you have widget. I don't know if you will see server template. I don't know if that's, it looks like it's new. I don't know what it is and I don't know how to use it, but that seems cool. <laughs> um, you will see widget. So click on widget and what widgets basically are is it's like a look into your Discord server without actually joining your Discord server. I'll show you more about how and what I mean by that. But when you go to the widget tab, it shows you enable server widget. It will be on by default. I think it is for me. Um, and the invite channel for when if people join, this is what they will see. So for me, it's just welcome. You can change it to any channel you'd like. So I'm just going to keep it as welcome. And these server ID, JSON, IP, AIP, that does not matter. It's fine. Keep it like that. And what you do want, though, is you want the pre-made widget here. Click copy. And once you click copy, it's in your little paste thing. Now, what you can do with this is you can post it on any website you own if you own a website. Um, pretty much anything that you have access to enable or edit embedded links. I will show you how to do that. So for me, I'm using a Google Sheets which is just a quick little mock-up I have here for no reason. It's my Mega Balls project with the fitness power. If you want to ask anything about fitness, please ask me in the comments below because I, I have good answers to fitness. So this is my page. And, you know, you can see all the stuff that I have to it. I haven't really edited much. But say you have a page that you um, want to advertise your Discord in or, you know, you got a movement that you have a Discord for. This is how you basically add it on to your page. So in Google Sheets, I know this is very similar on Wix and various other um, online website uh, page creators. You double tap here and you'll see this little wheel pop up. If you go to the left, you'll see embed. Once you click that, the URL thing will pop up here. Embed from the web. You don't want to do that. You want to embed code. Once you're here, all you do is paste your widget. This is your full widget that we saw over here. You can't see it fully here, but this is it full over here. And then you click next. It'll show you what it looks like here. Click insert. Once it's inserted, this is what it will look like. You can see all the members online. Now, what if I don't like seeing the members and I want to see what the channel looks like? This is where I can go back to my widget tab and scroll down here and click on let's say the chat say i want to advertise the chat and then there you go it's on your page right here you can scroll so say this site was actually an official site it would say our mission blah 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 whatever the case may be and then you scroll down and then it'll prompt you to kind of like hey you want to join our discord this is kind of what it looks like these are the members or whatever channel you have set for it i'm going to enter preview mode to make it look like i am a user just on the page this is what they'll see and then they'll see the Discord, and then you can click Connect. Once you click Connect, it would say Discord app launched. Or if you're logged in to the web browser, it will automatically join you in. And then you'll be greeted by the Discord chat, or whatever the case may be, wherever it throws you in. And that is pretty much that. That is how you can use widgets on Discord to advertise your Discord server with a little bit more detail other than just a normal invite link where they can't see in the server. Like I said, if you want to know how to get the widgets, all you have to do is go to the server settings, go to the widget category, and copy the link here, set the invite channel, and then you're good to go. So yeah, if you did like this video, please drop a like and subscribe for more. Peace.